900 pages of documents related to Jeffrey Epstein have been unsealed, revealing the names of dozens of associates, friends, and alleged victims of the disgraced pedophile. The names of more than 150 people mentioned in a lawsuit by Virginia Jufre, one of Epstein's most prominent accusers, were kept under seal for years until a federal judge ruled last month that there was no legal justification to keep them private. The documents once again put the spotlight on some of the world's most powerful people, including former U.S. President Bill Clinton and Prince Andrew. The British royal was accused by Jufre of sexually abusing her when she was 17 years old. Despite claiming he'd never met Jufre, Prince Andrew paid millions to settle her case against him. You just saw one of the reasons... Former U.S. President Bill Clinton is mentioned more than 50 times in the newly unsealed documents, including in the 2016 deposition by Johanna Schoberg, a former employee of Epstein. According to the records, Schoberg says that Epstein once told her that Clinton, quote, likes them young, referring to girls. The former president has not been accused of any crimes or any wrongdoing related to Epstein. Donald Trump is also referenced in the documents, but is also not accused of any wrongdoing. Right now, the only person who has been prosecuted is, is a woman. Ghislaine Maxwell, who certainly should be behind bars. But what's interesting in this you know, network of all these men who have been trafficking uh, young women, and yet the only person that's been prosecuted you know, is a woman. The highly anticipated documents also mentioned theoretical physicist Stephen Hawking. In an email included in the documents, Epstein told his girlfriend, Ghislaine Maxwell, she could offer a reward to friends of Jufre if they could disprove certain claims, including that the late physicist had taken part in a, quote, underage orgy. There are no further references to Hawking in the documents and no evidence that he took part in any illegal behavior. The documents released so far include no new allegations of wrongdoing, but do offer some insight into Epstein's social circles. Epstein killed himself in 2019 while awaiting trial on federal sex trafficking charges. More documents are expected to be unsealed or unredacted in the coming days. Brandon Chogri, City News.